Some South Jersey high school students want to make sure the tragic death of a classmate doesn't ever happen again. They launched a campaign to get drivers to slow down in school zones. And as Eyewitness News New Jersey reporter Cleve Bryan reports, lawmakers in Trenton are listening. It had the feeling of a pep rally, yet the passion from these Burlington City High School students asking drivers to slow down to 25 miles per hour comes from a source of pain. In May, their classmate Antoine Timbers Jr. was killed along Route 130, just footsteps from their school. His loss really made us want to do something about it. We wanted to make a change. Two weeks ago, students started standing outside the school with pictures of Antoine and signs asking drivers on Route 130 to slow down. They're calling it the 25 Saves Lives campaign. Save lives! It caught the attention of one local resident with the power to further the students' efforts. State Senator Diane Allen came to the high school to introduce several bills to make roads near schools safer. They include increasing speeding penalties, giving towns more flexibility for lowering speed limits, and making 25 miles per hour the 24-7 speed limit on Route 130 near Burlington City High School. We're going to be naming this bill the Antoine Timbers Jr. Bill. <laughs> Antoine's dad was overcome by emotions. And just for everybody to come together and, uh, and just do this in his honor, and not only for his honor, but the community as well, it's just... It, it just makes our family feel proud. Antoine was killed late at night by a man charged with DUI and reckless driving. So while these measures might not have prevented his death, supporters say as a whole, they raise the standard for safe driving near schools. If this can save one, two, three lives, it, it's done its job. Senator Allen says she hopes to bring some of these students up to Trenton whenever her traffic bills come up in committee. She wants the fellow lawmakers to see their enthusiasm and their resolve for change. In Burlington City, I'm Cleve Bryan, CBS3 Eyewitness News.